What's going on guys? Brock with Bassin 227 here. Got my fishing partner Keaton with me today. We're gonna come out and uh, give it a little shot fishing this pond. I can't guarantee that we're gonna catch anything. It's still a little chilly, but uh, we'll give it a shot and see what happens. We'll see you out there. All right guys, we're gonna give the old Wacky Rig Weightless Missile Baits 48. All right, buddy. Yep. See some shad coming up. Since the last time that I fished out here, we've had quite a bit of rain, so the water level out here is actually really, really high. All right, I'm gonna try something a little different. I'm gonna throw the KVD 1.0 square bill. I believe that's the chili crawl, if I'm not mistaken. Oh gosh, dang it. Yep. Just just nipped at it. Let's see if the jig can maybe get a bite. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, here we go, Keith. There we go. That's a good one here. Missile baits, wacky rig, 48, weightless. Pop right off, boy, I tell you what, that Denali N3 spinning rod, it gets it, man. Look at there, bud. I know. Oh, I have I know, it's got some big guys. You wanna see what it weighs? Yeah. 
All right. If you can see it, scales at zero. Scales at zero. Let's try it again. I'm not moving. All right, I think we can call it 2.4. 2.4. Four. That's a pretty good fish. All right, let's come over here and you can throw her back. Okay, grab it. Oh, that heavy. Uh, that's a no, it's a big one, just nice and easy. That was maybe a little too hard, but you just need to date. All you need to do is grab it and just set it in the water, okay? <laughs> Woo wee! That water cold? That water is cold. You know, this, this technique, this is probably one of the most, if not the most effective technique when you're pond fishing. And I know it's, it's a technique that can be extremely tedious because you gotta fish it really, really slow. But when it comes to, you know, fishing in a pond, a weightless worm, really a weightless worm, no matter how you're fishing it, whether it's Texas rig, whether it's wacky, a weightless worm always tends to produce. So I am glad after being out here for a while and not catching anything that we were able to at least land that one. All right, guys. So, um, Realized when I was editing my video, I did not make a, a, a closeout. Um, battery ended up dying in the middle of finishing fishing, so <clears throat> here we are. So basically, I only caught one fish. Um, that that was it. Water's still pretty cold. Um, you know, as you've seen in the video, uh, the one thing that I was using was the missile baits. 48. Give you a good look at it here. And I had it wacky rigged with a. <clears throat> this one is a size one. This is a Mustad Titan X Nico hook. And literally all I did was just basically set it up like that and as you can see with just a little bit of action those things just pulsate and um, I, I felt like with the water being as cold as what it was <clears throat> the the weightless presentation was going to be the better option um, Maybe the next go around, I'll opt for a lighter uh, nail weight and kind of go with the the Nico style. Um, rod was the Denali N3 spinning rod, medium power, fast action. It uh, it's a it, to me it's a flawless rod and it is extremely sensitive. Um, the bite was really really faint that I. It's just like it grabbed it and held on to it. Um, reel was the Daiwa Tatula uh, spinning reel. I absolutely love that thing. It's super light and paired up with that Denali M3. It's, it's the perfect spinning combo. Uh, line I had uh, 8 pound Seaguar red label. And if you're looking for a cheap affordable fluorocarbon that really does a good job, that line will do it. Um, so that was basically basically my setup um, you know I 
glad I was able to get something out where we were outside fishing and not stuck in here, you know, reviewing a product or whatnot. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't be too hard on me. This is my first video set here uh, on the GoPro and my first go around with the editing. So it's likely going to be very uh, cringy, but don't let that discourage you. I'm This is my first time using, you know, video editing software. So it'll get better as I go. So just make sure you stick with me through it. And I promise you it's going to get better. So with, with that being said, guys, that, that's it. Um, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. I'd love to have you join and be a part of the family that I got going on here and, and really pushing to uh, get the channel to grow. Make sure to hit that like button. Um, I, you know, I, I'm trying to find all the ways that I can to bust into this YouTube algorithm and, and really get my videos out there. And I'm hoping now with the GoPro I'll be able to get a little bit more better content for you guys so it'll help you know, keep everybody interested in what I got going on. So without further ado, that's going to do it for me, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. Peace.